This video is about windburn on steeplechase arborvitis. How you doing folks? Uh, right here we have a steeplechase arborvitae, four to five feet tall. Uh, in our area we have a prevailing westerly wind. Uh, you can see on these arborvitaes that this past winter with the real cold temperatures and the extreme winds at the same time that we got a lot of winter burn. You can see on the back side here, uh, the downwind side, there's just a little bit left surviving. Um, I feel right now that maybe steeplechase isn't as hardy as it, we think it is. I think we're going to have some problems with this in the coming years. Uh, again, we may not have a winter like we had this past winter for another 20 years, but at some point uh, I think they're more susceptible to winter damage than green giants. We'll take a step over here, two rows. Uh, see a field of green giants behind me. Same size, same planting, same age. Uh, everything culturally is the same and the green giants came through the winter fine. Uh, further down this field where the ground was a little bit wetter, we've had a lot more damage. Uh, so I think there's probably maybe an oxygen problem uh, where the roots just weren't as strong as we're in the better drained area. But we probably lost 50% of our steeplechase uh, this past winter due to winter burn, uh, winter freeze damage. Okay, well thank you very much Mike. and. Uh, we uh, at Highland Hill Farm, we recommend the Green Giant because we do believe it is a hardier plant than steeplechase. However, the steeplechase has its place in the landscape because it doesn't grow quite as big as the Green Giant. And uh, if you don't want something 30, 40 feet, you know, the Green Giant is not the plant for you. It would probably be the steeplechase, but you may have winter burn damage on them at some point in its life cycle, especially if you're in your Pennsylvania or uh, New York or New Jersey. Right, I think an Exposures also, if you're in a little bit more of a secluded area in a neighborhood where you have protection from the wind, you'd be fine. Your steeplechase would probably be better. Here we're in the wide open area here, so we get the wind all the time. So I think that makes them a little more susceptible to the winter burn. Okay, well, thank you very much, Mike. We'll see you. Thanks, Bill.